the system's life cycle. What is it? The system's life cycle, sometimes called the system's development life cycle, is a process for planning, creating, testing, and deploying an information system. Why do we need it? A system's life cycle is needed to make sure the original problem and the other problems, such as making sure the business doesn't overspend on a system, are solved. It makes sure to analyze the business spending limit and whether the system is actually needed by doing the feasibility study. At last, the system is also tested to make sure it works. The different stages include analysis, design, development, development, and evaluation. The analysis phase is where you look at alternative solutions which could be used to solve the problems, such as adapting the current system or buying an off-the-shelf solution. The design phase is when the system is designed, for example, the screen layout, the font color, size, and navigation throughout the system. The development phase is where the system starts to be written by the software programmers. They follow the requirement specification from the design stage and start to create the new system. Finally, the evaluation phase is where the two questions are answered. Does the finished system do what it's supposed to do? And does it solve the problem that was found in the first place? If the answer to the questions are yes, then a user document is created to educate the people using the system. If the answer is no, then the system analyst goes back and fixes the problem to make sure the answers to the questions are yes. Thank you.